Creating spiral curls can be a tedious process with traditional tools. As a result, over time, manufacturers have created tools to make this process faster and simpler. Using soft bender rods, more hair can be placed on the tool. Therefore, our sectioning pattern can be larger. For this design, the top of the ear is used as a focal point to divide the nape section of the hair. The remaining lengths are secured out of the way for later. Using the diameter of the tool, a vertical subsection is isolated off. The ends of the hair are secured in end papers and then starting from one end of the rod, the hair is wound in a spiral fashion up the length of the rod. In order to secure the tool in place, the ends of the rod are folded in onto the rod. This process is repeated throughout the nape section. The next section is divided at the crest of the head. Once again, using the diameter of the tool, a vertical subsection is isolated off. In order to avoid having the curls flow in all in one direction, an alternating wrapping direction is used for each section as we work our way up the head. Therefore, since the nape section was wrapped with the rod being positioned on top of the ends, the rod will now be placed under the ends and wrapped in the same manner throughout this section. As you can see, the nape section was wrapped with the curls going to the right, whereas this section is wrapped with the curls going to the left. The remaining top section is then wrapped with curls going to the right, with the finished result as shown. The result provides a softer spiral curl, ideal for medium to long lengths. When not being used for perms, this is also an excellent setting method for spiral curls on damp hair.